Hi guys, this is Karen and I am so excited. I got, well, this beautiful thing from Unique Beauty. This is the Beauty Trends uh, Fashion Spring Cleaning. This is basically, if you open it, there are three yeah three eyeshadow palettes okay so this is a new brand i never tried anything from them this is the first time i bought something from them they're based in the uk and this is it this is what i got mm. And I'm so excited okay so let's open it so as I showed you it opens like this and here you have three eyeshadow palettes let's go over them one by one the first one is called bubble time now this is really really small look at my hand size of my hand give or take so very very small but look at that beautiful thing so i showed you this let's open it and this is how it looks like from the inside look at these amazing green shades this is so beautiful oh my god now i haven't swatched anything from this palette yet i just opened it looked at it was okay so this is the first one the greens that was bubble time and the second one is me myself and i which is which is this palette okay and look at the shades they are amazing look at that this is so beautiful okay and let's see the third one third one is called pamper me so this is pamper me and let's look at it in the ins okay that one forgot all about it this one came crumbling okay so i'm trying to show it to you without it falling all over so it came like that crumbling okay never mind so hmm, let's do some swatches and then let's do a look i don't know which look i'm going to choose this is so hard okay let's start with bubble time this is so cute okay so let's start and swatch this beautiful palette okay now let's start with bubble bath which is this beautiful green shade here look at it it is just amazing i hope they are pigmented as they look okay and starting bubble bath very creamy let's swatch the inside of my arm so this is bubble bath and then i'll take so this one was bubble bath and now i'm swatching bath salt and then i'll swatch this guy here can't see the name and then i'll go like this so from here to here to here okay so i swatched the first one and now bath salt very creamy for these mats and okay exfoliate looks amazing as well but it's very sheer so it's kind of a topper I guess let's try again okay this is beautiful and then I'm going to take chill okay 
Okay, very very creamy and very very pigmented as you can see I guess this one is a duochrome yeah okay let's take another finger and we have Lufa and Lufa is also a duochrome look at that this is so beautiful and candlelight which is the dark green okay so this was bubble time ah, this is so beautiful oh my god i lost my voice because this is so beautiful okay and so pigmented okay now let's go to me myself and i let's see it again this is how it looks like and i'm going to start from here and upwards so this one will be the first one which is head wrap okay we'll do it on the same and okay this is so gorgeous and towel which is a mat okay now look at that this is amazing okay and let's take cleansing looks like a duochrome as well definitely let's take a bit more look at that beautiful color and body scrub let's take body scrub beautiful red orangey color and now face mask which is kind of a gold color yeah and cool but also changes colors or maybe it's metallic i think it's metallic it doesn't change colors and the last one is massage which is a matte taupey shade let's take a bit more very easy to swatch i don't know how they're going to perform on the eyes but for swatches they are magnificent look at that this is beautiful okay so this was me myself and i and the last one was pamper me the broken one okay so because it's broken it's so hard to show it this is a bummer let's try anyway yeah okay so I'll start from the broken one like that same shape and let's take spa and I'll use my other hand arm let's take spa which came down a bit broken and And then manicure, which is a matte pink. I don't know if you're going to see that on me. Yeah, this is manicure. Let's add some more to manicure. Okay, and then pamper me, which was look a duochrome. Yeah, I think it is a duochrome beautiful shade and then zen which is a dark blue okay let's add some more it's not pigmented enough i think this one is it has a bit of a glitter in it and now hot stone which is a brown shade and last one is gua sha which is a properly color yeah this is it 
these are the shades. Oh yeah, like that. <laughs> okay, I don't know. I have to say that from all three palettes, I'm less impressed with this one. The shades, oh, well, they're nice, but not that impressive. Maybe on the eyes. And I didn't really get the color scheme. I think it's all over the place. And I didn't like, well, I mean, the texture from the the dark blue here. I don't know. It's not the same as these here, which perform better, but again, just swatching. Now, I'll, I won't use the crumbly one. Let's take me, myself, and I. And let's try and create a look using these shades. Let's see it again. So I'm going to start with this shade here. It's called Massage. And let's take a clean brush. Please, please. I need to have a clean brush. Okay, where is my brush? Clean or not, it's missing in action. Maybe it fell down. Okay, so I'm just taking my brush and going with my... Oh, I forgot. Of course, I forgot to prime my eyelids. So I'm just taking my LA Girl. This is the Pro Primer HD Definition Eyeshadow Primer. So I'm just going to prime my eyelids just like that and I love this stick because it's so easy to apply just taking my sponge and adding it a tiny bit okay let's go back to massage okay I'm all over yeah wasn't a good idea to wear a white shirt when you're swatching okay so just taking my small mirror because this one doesn't come with a mirror so take it in mind and the bundle cost me 55 pounds and I think 13 or 17 more pounds for shipping so wasn't cheap but it's an indie brand and i really wanted to try them and it looked beautiful on instagram so i thought why not why not try something that is not mainstream maybe it's a gem but if i won't try i want to know right it took about a month to arrive I placed the pre-order it was supposed to ship on the 14 I think 14 of March and it took about a month to arrive okay so this is above my crease I think it's beautiful okay I'm taking a flat brush and let's take towel which is if you forgot this is towel here no here this is towel i was <laughs> showed you the gold one sorry about that is there access i don't know so i'm just adding it to the outer corner of my eyelid and the inner corner as well. Very pigmented as you can see. I didn't take a lot and it's very pigmented. So I'm just adding to the inner corner 
and out of corner. like that very very pigmented oh my god oh, too pigmented okay now hmm, let's add some from body scrub which is the red shade here body scrub this guy here and add close to the brown on both sides just want to keep I'm trying at least to keep a tiny bit in the middle without shade but I took the wrong brush so I'm just tapping here and on the other side as well And now I want to take with my finger head wrap, which is this beautiful pink color here. It's pink. I don't know, it doesn't look pink in the camera. In the camera it looks orange, but it's pink. Yeah, it is pink. Pink with purple, something beautiful. So I'm just tapping in the middle. of the lash with my finger just like that and let's do the same on the other side let's pick some more on my finger and keep in mind this is first impression I have some fallout here. Yeah, I'll clean it in a minute. Okay, now let's take a blending brush and blend it a bit. And on the other side, don't like neglect, don't neglect the blending. It's important. Sometimes I don't have time to blend, so I skip it. But if you have time, don't skip it. Let's take a tiny bit from cleansing. I really want to try cleansing as well, which is this beautiful white shade here take a clean finger and let's add a tiny bit on top okay this is beautiful okay this is really really beautiful beautiful shades now let's take a flat brush and take a towel and add it to the lower lash line and outer corner of the lower lash line to be exact until the middle And I'm going to add, let's try at least, from Head Wrap, that pink shade that you saw orange on camera. What a beautiful shade. So this is the final look. Well, I used all the shades except of the gold one. I didn't get how to use the gold one. But I used all the other shades. I used this one in my crease. 
this one in the outer corner and inner corner this is more in the middle of the outer and inner corner and then I use this guy here pink one and this guy here so I didn't use the gold I don't know how to use the gold I can use it in my inner corner just so I can say that I used all the shades as my brush so let's take pencil brush and take from face mask see if it's packing anything and add to the inner corner no it didn't do anything um, let's try again yeah now we can see it here so yeah, now I can say that I used all the shades in the palette. Okay, so what can I say about this palette? Well, first of all, the colors are very pigmented, very easy to work with. I don't know about durability because, you know, I just wore it, so I don't know. If I'm going to experience something out of the ordinary, I will leave it down in the description box. But this one really reminds me of the Colourpop Super Shock uh, with the consistency of it. This one is a beautiful duochrome. I think it's a beautiful palette so far. I think it is very pigmented, very easy to apply, very buttery. And I like it a lot. So this is the first palette I used. And as I say, the name was me, myself. And I, well, didn't have the end here, just I. So, me, myself, I. I think it's a misspell. But this is a beautiful palette. Okay, so this is the first palette I used from the trio that I got from Unique Beauty. And look at this beautiful case. Now you can buy them individually. They cost less. They cost, I think, 15 pounds. So, I guess... Uh, I paid more for this beautiful case, which is magnificent. Let's see the swatches again. So again, I wasn't impressed in the swatches from this palette, but I have to try it. And of course I forgot to add mascara. Okay, so I'm just using my Essence Volume Stylist 18 hours and I'll be right back. I'm back with mascara and I zoomed you in a bit closer so you can see up close the look and I looked up close and this is a beautiful very beautiful look very pinkish brownish reddish kind of look well I like it a lot and I like the quality and I think it turned out beautifully. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section down below. And I will create additional looks using this palette. I still need to check the other two palettes that are here. So I'll create a look using Bubble Time and Pamper Me. And then I can give you my honest review of this brand this is as I said unique beauty and well I don't know look at the beautiful packaging I think it's adorable and it's a nice addition to my collection okay so this is everything from me if you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let me know what you think about the look did you try this palette this brand did you have a chance to check this brand? Did you have a chance to check out these palettes? Let me know in the comment section down below. I'll be happy to hear from you. Let's take another look. I think it turned out beautifully and I like the quality of these eyeshadow palettes. So, big thumbs up from me and I'll catch you all in my next video. Bye!